Hey guys, what's up? It's Dark Shadow Rage, and we're back with more Resident Evil Remake HD. If you remember the last video, uh, I was talking about the Magnum. Well, I was being a complete idiot because I could have gotten a Magnum really early, and I uh, didn't do that. So we're going to go do that right now. Then we're going to uh, do stuff in here. Uh, of course, DX Tour is adjusting, so please don't mind the frame rate, as always. Okay, so... We don't need this right now. We don't need that right now. All we need to do right now is take our wing crest. We're gonna exit the red residence for right now. We're gonna come right back. But we're just gonna backtrack to the grave, which we should have done in the first place, but I was a complete moron. It shouldn't take us very long to get there, and it shouldn't take us very long to do this. <coughs> Excuse me. I bet Jill had waffles this morning. Before she came into this place, I had waffles. Why'd you guys have a breakfast? Waffles or pancakes? I have waffles. Waffles are good. I bet Jill likes waffles. But she also might like pancakes. Being a complete idiot that I was, I could have gotten the Magnum like right away, and I didn't because I thought I had to find the other two crests when I've already beaten this game several times. I've gotten the Magnum, like, no problem. But the other two crests, other three crests, I should say, are actually in the alternate grave that pops up. Quite a bit of a backtrack, I apologize, but I'd rather do it now than not do it at all. Of course, we're not going to use it until way later, but then again, you can also be using this as a guide. So if you get stuck or something, I do something stupid, but you'll know what to do. So hopefully it's helpful in that way. So all we gotta do is just go back down here. We're just gonna go get the magnum right now. Don't even need to go near Lisa's cabin because we're not going to that. It's just right here. I did say in the little text box that we're going to do it in the next video, and that's what we're doing. Use it here. That opens up, that gives you all the crests. See, there you go. Take it. Take it. And take. Now, what you need to do is examine each and one of them, each one of them, and turn to the back. Push the button to press that and bring that up. Ta-da! Should have did this in the first place, but me being stupid didn't happen. They just put them in; they automatically go into the correct slot that they go in, like so. And our prize is revealed. Ta-da! Da-da-da-da! Little Zelda. Okay, now we got our magnum. Let's get out of here. Should have did that last video, but no.
Okay, now back to the residence. Jill can stop being stupid. which would be handy later. This is that green herb as well. We're going to deposit the magnum in our item box and we'll be good. Then we're just going to continue on. Do not waste your magnum on normal enemies at all. That is a crucial weapon for a little way later. See, I didn't get stuck that time. I know where I was going. <laughs> I apologize for coughing like that. It's not something I normally do on recordings. Ugh, that's for sure. Alright, we're back. This is probably one of the creepiest places in the game, I think. Magnum Gat. Awesome. So first thing we need to do, not that way, Joe. Push this box. Not that way, this way. <coughs> Need to go in here. Is it as creepy looking? Dang. It's so quiet, too. We shouldn't take that off right now. We can't go in there. We can go in there, can we? Yeah, we can go in there. No, that wasn't part of our oh. deal. Like I said, I but it's not necessary to destroy stars. What about my family? If I play my cards right.
Well, that was kind of creepy. Jill. Barry, I heard someone talking. Oh, you heard. I think age is starting to take its toll. Talking to myself is becoming a bad habit. Talking to yourself? You alright? What's gotten into you? I'm getting you worried, aren't I? But don't, I'm alright. I guess this creepy mansion has gotten to my nerves. Anyway, I think I'll go outside, get some fresh air for a change. And get eaten by a monster. Don't worry, I'm just going to get some fresh air. If I'm lucky, I'll get to waste some monsters along the way. Oh, Barry. Plant 42 report. Well then, that shadow creeped me out for a second. I was like, what is that? Nothing special. Of course, we can't do anything down there yet. Disgusting bathroom. What was that? Oh no. Trigger finger slip. No, it's not the, at least I'm not to burn you. Well, we came here for the residence key. That's what we needed. Examine. Room 001. Gallery. What's in here? Oh. That room. <clears throat> That's a special room. Even after beating this game several times, it's still generally terrifying. 
You might not be able to notice, but I'm pretty freaked out right now. Even though most of the time I know what's gonna happen, I know what's gonna be there, it's just it's generally creepy. You. Oh, crap. Now, if you would have seen from like the, the shadow, the dude was like hanging from the ceiling and he dropped from the ceiling. It's just a woo hoo boy. Self defense gun, yeah, I'll take that. Suicide note. He still turned into one of them anyways, so it's kind of a bummer, isn't it? Okay. I think there was something in the bathtub in here. Aha, uh -huh, yeah, I need to come back and get that. At least we don't have to worry about crimson heads, though. And that's gonna stay there for later. That's going to be super handy. <sighs> this room. I remember when I first came here on the GameCube. All my nope. Well, might as well do it. We have no other choice. 
Uh, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Damn, four shotgun shells on normal? There's more shells in this room. Hey, look, a giant picture of an ass. I see you. Might be a waste of an acid shell, but whatever. I don't like this bastard. Oh, it wasn't a complete waste because he died. And that's not a waste either. I need to come in here for that book. Hey, look, there's a first aid box, so that's handy to have. God, those things look so much creepier in HD. I had no idea. You seen them on the GameCube? They were really creepy, as it was. But good lord. I'm just thankful there are shotgun shells in here. Okay, so... Other than the first aid stuff, I think that's all that's in here for now. Bye bye, spider. <clears throat> Creepy bastard. I should hopefully be getting more acid shells sooner or later. I hope. Okay, so I'm gonna drop off my lighter since I don't need it right now. Okay. Still can't believe they took that many shots. Dang. This whole area is so creepy because it has like no music. That is so disturbing. Because <clears throat> you know sometimes silence is the creepiest of all because it's so silent. It's just like, ugh. Oh, this next area is the Aqua Ring. I don't know if I should have made a safety save or not. Probably should. Yeah, before we go, no, I'm gonna make a. I don't normally want to like waste all my ink ribbons, but in this case, it's kind of necessary to make a safety save because of the Aqua Ring.
because I don't want to do all that again. <clears throat> we already got the magnum, and I don't want to record all that again. So better safe than sorry. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I know it's a lot of backtracking, but whatever. It's the nature of Resident Evil. I'm gonna drop that off for now. And we'll take the pink ribbon. Make it on the second slot. Just in case I do have to start over and re record everything again. So I'll have my backup saved there. Hopefully that won't be the case, but you know, it's always nice to have backups. So when you're recording these things, you know, you try to make them look as good as you can, but also try to make them helpful. <clears throat> That's what I'm trying to do with this anyways, at least. As much as I possibly can. Ah, wrong button. One second. Okay, there we go. Time to go down to Aqua Ring and pay an old friend a visit. <clears throat> if you guys remember from the GameCube stream, that was kind of intense. I want to save that one for last. I'm gonna put the other one, push the other ones first. Okay, so. In you go. Hopefully we can make it through here in one shot without any problems. That's what I'm hoping for. I'm also using the original tank controls, if you couldn't tell from the very first video. I'm using the tank controls, not the alternate controls, because they suck. Okay. Time to go. Time to run. Go, Jill. Go, 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 go. Go, Jill. Go, 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 Jill. Go. Whoo, yeah, that went a lot better than it did on the GameCube run. That went a lot better. Wow. 
I'm pleasantly surprised and I'm happy. Now this part was a pain. A pressure shelter, yay! Oh hi Neptune, you big ass shark. I will take the first aid box. Oh, mixed herb. Not bad. That's a cool looking shot, Jill. Yeah. Okay. So, where's the map? I know there was a map in here. Yeah, I definitely can't go that way. Oh, there it is. Yeah, this tells you in case of a drop in oil pressure control, open valve three. Detected. Locking all doors to achieve maximum safety. Let's see if I remember how to do this right. Hopefully, I can do this right. Reaching 30% of pressure threshold. We gotta go back to this thing over here, I believe. Three. Reaching 50% of pressure threshold. Activate emergency drainage system immediately. That's awesome. All you need to do is just read your environment a little bit and you got it. Just explore your look around your environment and say, oh, that's what we need to do. Hello, shotgun shells. You damn right I'm going to take that. Is that all that was over here? <clears throat> oh, look at you. Flap, flap, flap. Hi, Neptune, you big ass shark.
Yeah, I need to push it in the water. Kindly push it, Jill. Push it. What am I doing wrong? Last thing I need to do is get eaten by this freaking shark, and that would suck. Balls. Oh, I see. Doing wrong here. I know what I'm supposed to do. Give me a second. Let me think real quick. Oh yeah. I completely forgot to do that part. Don't turn it on while you push it. That's a stupid idea. Yeah, how about a fried giant shark? That seems to work. Oh yeah. Residence key. All right, now that we got everything here, we're gonna go back to our save point and save. Floppy chart. Floppy shark. Magnum rounds. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to come back and get those before we save. It's just something that needs to be done. Thankfully, it's gonna be a quick and easy trip because we're right here. gonna use a gallery key and uh, get it used then we're gonna run back down there and grab those magnum runs that works out for the better I guess I really didn't need that safety save but you know what it's better safe than sorry
Damn right, I'm gonna take those magnum rounds. Let's go drop the stuff off and make a save for this video. Usually I try to do one save per video, but it's called for two. Oh well. We know where we're coming next video. We're gonna go into the gallery and we're gonna finish off the residence. Like, sometimes you might notice that uh, when I stop the recording, I rec start recording again. That's only because I want the video to stay synchronized. I don't know why, but sometimes when I, like, record for long periods of time, the audio just slowly goes out of the sync. So, these videos are actually, like, I stop at a point that has, like, no music, and then I continue recording again. That's only so I can keep it synchronized. I'm going to drop that herb off there, and we're going to take our ink ribbon. Gonna make a save. Might as well use number two, right? Anyway, this has been Resident Evil Remake episode number five, part five. I hope you guys are enjoying this walkthrough and I hope you guys find it really helpful. Uh, so, what do you have a request? Do you have a pancake or do you have a waffle or whatever? I think Jill had waffles. Let me know in the comments below. Because is Jill a waffle or is she a pancake person? Who knows? If you enjoyed this video and find it helpful, please leave a like, favorite, and comment and share with your friends. I greatly appreciate it and thank you again for watching. Take care, my friends. Bye.